Hello, it's uh, Kuldeep Clare from Sterling Lawyers. I specialise in employment law. And um, today we're going to be talking about a, a topic that's been very much in the news today, the subject of non-disclosure agreements, often shortened to NDAs. This is a topic which has been very much in the news uh, very recently in the last few days um, because of a, a case uh, involving a, a very important businessman. Uh, but uh, it's because uh, he's been named as uh, someone who signed a, a non-disclosure agreement uh, because of allegations that were made against him by various employees. And um, he's been named in a newspaper as someone who uh, was supposedly harassed and bullied uh, employees and then signed a non-disclosure agreement and uh, this newspaper is seeking to name him and he's, he has in fact been named in Parliament and uh, you'll f you can find his name actually on social media and in fact in other news sources um, uh, and this has all happened despite the fact that he's, he has signed a non-disclosure uh, agreement. Anyway, I'm not here to educate you about what's been going on in the news. I, I just want to tell you about how uh, non-disclosure agreements may be relevant to you and your situation in your employment uh, or otherwise as well. A non-disclosure agreement is a means of signing um, uh, uh, your right to make a claim against your employer and uh, holding what your, what your claim is and the nature of your claim confidential so that you're not going to repeat it to any third party um, and uh, you're bound to uh, make uh, and regard that as confidential and if you then disclose it to a third party your employer um, may then take an action against you and in return for signing the confidentiality agreement, the non-disclosure agreement, the employer will pay you a sum of money. So a non-disclosure clause or a confidentiality clause is actually part of uh, a settlement agreement and we've done uh, a video on settlement agreements already so a non-disclosure agreement is not something special or particular in law a non-disclosure clause or a confidentiality clause is part of a settlement agreement in an employment situation so uh, the crucial thing is it, it's important in an employment situation to it's vital in fact to have legal advice and to, for a lawyer to sign a settlement agreement uh, with a confidentiality clause in it for it to be valid. One thing that can never happen, and this is something which concerns a lot of people at the moment uh, and politicians as well about the validity of non-disclosure agreements, is it's never possible to sign away the right to make a complaint to the police about any illegal activity, any bullying or any assaults or any um, uh, unlawful uh, harassment that's taken place um, even though you signed a non-disclosure agreement. So if you want to report something to the police later, you're still able to do so despite having signed a non-disclosure agreement. It just means that you can't pursue a claim in, in the tribunal or the civil courts against your um, employer. So that's the reason for signing a non-disclosure agreement and the benefit of doing so is that it avoids the stress of pursuing a tribunal claim or a court claim um, because they can be very stressful um, and uh, it gets the, the matter sorted out uh, uh, quickly, it gets it over and done with very quickly and that's a benefit to the employer uh, uh, who, who is uh, being potentially sued as well. It gets it all over and done with, it gets it sorted you get uh, a sum of money and it's all complete and over and done with. If you need advice on a potential, um, a potentially signing a non-disclosure clause or, or a non-disclosure agreement in an employment situation, uh, then please feel free to contact us. I'm, I can advise you on that. You can have a consultation directly or we can have a consultation through Skype or over the phone and we can discuss it further. Thank you very much.